This is a custom-made trailer for a Hobie Mirage Island Adventure sailboat, welded uh, using the Multiplaz 3500, uh, and you'll see that I did some well. I did welding and plasma cutting uh, using the Multiplaz. Trailer's got a wheel well in it so that the wheel uh, spare tire mounts below the kayak. If I was going to change anything about the trailer, I probably would have beefed that up. I used half inch square tubing there. I would go beefier. I extended the trailer slightly and used a salvage boat roller. Those brackets that you see sitting up are designed to hold three quarter inch EMT conduit. That's what I use to make rollers. The three quarter inch uh, EMT takes um, a pool noodle. So I have a readily available cheap source of, of pretty good foam. Um, trailer came from Harbor Freight, so the Harbor Freight red uh, color I, I matched a bit. The, this Krylon banner red paint does a good job. I painted the, the fenders with the cherry red. The Krylon Max paint on paint is water-based and it was it didn't work at all for me. I, I would never buy that again and I ended up having to go for those places where I really wanted to paint with a brush with the Rust-Oleum Sunburst Red. This is the finished trailer with the foam all mounted on it. You see I have a V at the front that's going to accept the bow of the uh, Mirage Island Adventure sailboat. Roller there with the foam on them. You see that they roll quite nicely. Desire was to make sure that we could single hand, that, that my wife could single hand getting the kayak on and off the trailer. And that works quite well. It's the completed trailer again, just looking down the length of it. Had to make brackets to hold the foam on. Really have had no issues with the foam wanting to come off on it. Looking at the mounted wheel again, I would improve uh, the wheel. I would beef that up a bit. And there's the island adventure sitting on the trailer. The bow sits there in the V, holds it quite nicely. Once you put a strap on it, it can't move forward or sideways. Pontoon, pontoon spit up on the, or outriggers spit up on the outside there. And lengthening the trailer uh, just made it more in line with the, the length of the kayak there, or the sailboat. And then the last thing that I did was add some finishing touches for my Irish wife, making sure it was custom for her. So I cut the labels out of vinyl. Thanks for watching.